Hey y'all, it's your girl Mo of All Things Mo L. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be doing something a little bit different. I mean, it's gonna be a product review, but I'm putting a little twist to it. So lately I've been picking up a lot of new products, but they were from lines that I already love and know. Um, it's just that these particular products are either new or I just have never tried them and I decided to pick them up and go ahead and give them a try. So I decided it would be cool if I started a series. First impressions of a product from a line that I already love. I know that's a long title, but we are gonna work with it. Okay. So for today, I am going to be talking about the main choices Tropical Moringa line. That line, y'all, is bomb. I mean, I just don't have any other word to describe it. The smell by itself is enough to make me wanna buy it, but the products are actually great. I mean, they do what they say. When it says endless moisture, that's, that's exactly what it does. I already had in my stash, I had the shampoo, which is what I have cleansed my hair with today. The leave-in conditioner, well, it's a rinse out or leave-in conditioners, but y'all know how I feel about the main choice conditioners. If I can leave them in, I'm going to, because they're so good. Curly braid out glaze, which is probably my favorite item from this collection. I just love how versatile it is. I can use it for braid out, but I can use it for a twist out. I can use it for a wash and go. I just love that product. Then they have two refresher products from this line that I also have, the restorative spray and the sealing cream and like i said these are kind of products that you can use to refresh your hair if you have an old style and you're not quite ready to wash you can go in with this one first and then this on top and then style as you please the one item that i did not have was the sweet oil and honey endless moisture mask now i'm just gonna be honest y'all the reason why i've never tried this mask before is purely because of the price i mean i just personally feel some kind of way paying 15 16 17 dollars for a product that only has eight ounces like i just it doesn't sit well with my spirit so that's why i have avoided this mask i happened upon this product in Marshalls one day and I'm like okay Marshalls is starting to carry some select main choice items it still <laughs> is a little pricey it's I got it for $13.99 but I just figured okay I want to try it really badly so I'm gonna go ahead and pay for it now see how I like it and then kind of go from there so what I'm gonna do is like a first impressions and just kind of give you my thoughts on it and um, let you know how I feel about it so like I said my hair has been washed so my hair is in twists because this is how i detangle um after i shampoo my hair i will go in with a rinse out conditioner and um detangle it and then i'll put it up in these twists to get ready for deep conditioning just so that it stays detangled of course i have my clips here so i'm going to clip up my hair and I'm just going to apply the deep conditioner section by section. I'm just gonna start with this first section in the back. So this is what my hair is looking like before deep conditioning. The directions say, after shampooing with Tropical Moringa Sweet Oil and Honey Endless Moisture Shampoo, apply a generous amount from roots to ends. Massage gently into the hair, especially the ends, and distribute evenly. Cover hair with a plastic cap and sit under the dryer for 15 minutes or leave on up to um, one hour without heat. Rinse thoroughly with cool water. So I'm kind of going to follow the directions. I am going to apply it and then I'm going to actually sit under my steamer and I probably will leave it in for like 30 minutes without a plastic cap. I never rinse my hair with cool water because I have low porosity hair. When you rinse your hair with cool water, it snaps shut and then whatever product that you put on after is not gonna penetrate. So I won't be rinsing my hair with cool water. But we got our first section back here. So let's go ahead and go in with the product and see how we feel about it. The smell, I just, the smell, this, this smells so good. It just smells like what hopes and dreams are made of. It just smells so good. Take about that much, rub it in my hands and just go on into the hair. It 
the directions that you pay close attention to the end so making sure to do that so right off the bat <laughs> this stuff is packed with moisture like I can feel the oils from the product like on my hands when I do this like this stuff is so moisturizing and it feels really really good going on to my hair it just feels great so I'm just twisting it back up and then I'm gonna go on to the next twist and I'm just gonna do that to my entire head Okay, so one thing I will say that I've noticed with this deep conditioner is that I'm being pretty heavy handed with it because I'm always heavy handed with my deep conditioners. But what I'm noticing is my hair seems to just be like drinking it up. Like if you notice, you can see some residue from the deep conditioner, but it's not just sitting on top of my hair like some deep conditioners can do. I can tell that it's actually penetrating my strands which is what we want what's the purpose of deep conditioning if it's just going to sit on top of the strands and not penetrate the strands so the deep conditioner is applied to my entire head what i'm going to do is go ahead and sit under my steamer probably for about 20 to 30 minutes once i rinse out the deep conditioner i will come back on camera and show you guys how my hair is looking and give you guys my final thoughts okay y'all i'm back so i have just rinsed out that mask from my hair no other product is in my hair right now it is freshly rinsed and y'all <laughs> i mean i'm not even surprised i knew how i was going to feel about the product but my hair feels so good it's so soft i can feel the moisture it also feels hydrated like not just moisturized but hydrated needless to say i am a fan of this deep conditioner will i use it again definitely i'm going to use up that container will i repurchase it not for full price i did end up looking at um sally's website while i was sitting under the steamer and that stuff is 17.99 at sally's so i ain't paying that for it but if I can catch it on sale or if I can catch it in Marshalls again, yes, I will repurchase it, um, but but not full price, no. Love this mask. I definitely recommend it if you're looking for a product that is moisturizing. I actually recommend this full line. There is not one product in this line that I have tried that I didn't like, and I have now tried the whole entire line. So I definitely recommend this, uh, the main choice tropical moringa collection it is bomb um the smell like i said is heavenly it is very moisturizing um and it just it just does everything that i need it to do so we're gonna stop right here i'm gonna go ahead and style my hair but i'm gonna do that off camera so i hope you guys found this informative if you liked the video please comment please like please subscribe and please share and i will see you guys in my next one bye